What is up guys, welcome back to the channel. Dylan Grubb here with Extreme Outdoorsman. If you guys are new here to the channel, make sure to go hit that subscribe button for me. Help me hit 6,000 subs, guys. I am almost there, only a couple hundred away. So I would really appreciate it if you guys went and told your friends and family to hit that subscribe button for me. And also, while you guys are here, hit that thumbs up button. Try to get this video to 200 likes. That would be awesome, guys. So. I am just getting out here on the water. I'm fishing on my favorite lake, or favorite inland lake called Lake Orion. It's like 10, 15 minutes from my house. But I am just getting out here and it's a beautiful day out here, like 70, 80 degrees. And I'm one of the only boats out here. It's a little windy today. Got some white caps behind me. It's been windy all day, but I'm pretty excited to get out here and catch some fish. I've been coming out here the past couple days and the fishing hasn't been the greatest. I've been maybe catching like one or two fish. So hopefully we can get on some big fish today. The main goal is just to get on a bunch of fish today, no matter the species, largemouth bass, rock bass, or northern pike. So hopefully we can just get on a bunch of fish today. That would be really cool. But I tied on a bunch of different baits. I spent like 15, 20 minutes when I got here at the launch putting on different baits from jigs, chatter baits, flukes. So I'm gonna try some different baits that I haven't thrown in a little while out here and hopefully connect into that one big fish. So we'll see you guys on the GoPro. So guys, I'm just rolling up to the first spot of the day. It's really nice out here today, like 70, 80 degrees, pretty hot and the water is super clear. So I'm throwing this green and black chatter bait right now with a havoc on the back. Um, pit boss havoc pit boss it's green pumpkin with red flakes and this is always a really good bait out here on lake Orion. i just rolled up put the power poles down and i'm working this flat area right now where the wind is pushing into this there's a weed patch over there so i'm casting over the weed patch I'm just working this flat right here it should hold some fish i always catch fish in this little flat area right here but really nice day out today i'm excited to be on the water hopefully get on some big fish today the fishing has been pretty slow lately so like i said earlier the number one goal is to just get on a bunch of fish no matter the species so let's see what happens today hopefully i can connect onto a big one that would be super cool water temperature is at 81 degrees right now i just had a nibble here a second ago i wasn't recording at but there's fish in here guys oh there's a pike right as i said that super cool i saw him eat it <laughs> he ate it right at the boat pretty cool guys on the chatterbait i fished all day yesterday for northerns and didn't even i think i got whoa i don't want to get hooked so guys there's my first pike of the day he drilled that chatterbait right at the boat i've only been out here probably like 15 20 minutes but really nice fish probably like a 25 26 something like that not super big but beautiful pike I'm gonna release it fish on <laughs> that was pretty cool i was just about to pull my lure out of the water and he grabbed it i saw him come grab it little largemouth bass probably a pound he drilled a chatterbait though that was pretty cool i saw him eat it just like that pike he followed it all the way to the boat chunky one too look at the belly on it little guy better put him back he's bleeding See you, buddy. See you when you're five pounds.
Well, two fish so far, guys. That's pretty good. It's a better streak than I've had in the past couple days. It's been tough. So, I'm trying to get on like a four or five pounder today. That'd be really cool. But I gotta put a new trailer on. He messed it up. Then get back to casting. Hopefully, land a giant. Lake Orion Giant. Oh, there is a hit. Fish on. Northern. <laughs> Little guy. Still, it's a fish, though. Probably, like, 18 inches <laughs> little guy dang he ate that chatter bait guys check that out it's like all the way down his freaking the hooks all the way at his eye pretty nice one it's always fun hooking up into a pike they definitely put up a good fight little guy they're biting today already got three fish only been out here probably 45 minutes seems like they're all hitting it right at the boat a lot of these fish are falling it all the way to the boat i guess they want a moving baits today i've been marking a lot of fish though on the graph right on the drop off so i might throw a jig here in a minute if the chatterbait bite slows down but it seems like they want the chatterbait right now the bigs might want a jig though so what i'm doing with this chatterbait i'm just casting it out popping it off the bottom a couple times and then railing it in super slow just switching up my my retrieve i'm just working these shorelines right now casting right up in shallow water and bringing it out to the weeds Most of the fish are in the weeds, so I might work parallel with the shoreline. Cast along this way. Bunch of weeds down through here. There's fish stacked up in here. I'm working like four to six foot of water right now. That's what I got the boat in. So guys, I'm getting ready to pack up and move to another spot, but the fishing is going pretty good so far. I think I got three fish so far. I got those two northern pikes and a little bass. So it seems like the fish are biting a little more today, more than they have in the past couple days, to be honest, because I've been coming out here, like I said, a couple days, and the fishing hasn't been the greatest. So it's going pretty good so far. I've only been out here probably like 45 minutes to an hour but I'm getting ready to move to another spot. And a lot of these fish, it seems like they are wanting that moving bait, the chatter bait. I threw a jig around for like probably 15 to 20 minutes and no hits. So I'm gonna move to another spot where I know a lot of fish are. Hopefully connect into that one big fish, guys. That's what I'm shooting for today or a bunch of fish. So let's go get after them and catch a big one.
if you guys saw that, but a fish just jumped right here. That was pretty cool. There's fish in here. I'm marking them on bottom. There's a fish. Oh, nice bass. <laughs> oh, no. Got off. What the heck? That was a nice fish, guys. Dang it. He drilled the chatterbait too. That was sweet. That was probably like a three and a half, four pounder. I had audience too there watching on shore right here. Dang it. That was cool. I should have cut my rod down so he didn't jump, but it is what it is. That was a nice fish. Dang it. Come on. I need that big bass. That was that was the fish. Dang it. <laughs> wow guys, that was a pretty nice one. Probably like a three and a half, four pounder. I lost them right at the boat. It was pretty cool. I was just throwing along that shoreline right there and he destroyed that chatterbait almost right at the boat too. It was pretty cool. I saw him eat it and I also had a little audience on shore. There was a couple workers watching me, but that was super cool guys. Hopefully get on some more fish. I just moved to another new spot. I'm working right in the middle of the lake in like eight to 10 foot of water. I'm working this big weed patch. So hopefully get on a fish right here and just keep catching them guys. Fish on. There was another one with it. First fish in probably like 45 minutes. Nice little bass. No giant, but it's a start of another bite. <laughs> nice fish. I'm out here in the middle of the lake, right on this like weed patch right here. It's like eight to 10 foot of water, but he drilled that chatterbait. There was another fish with him too. Pretty cool. See ya. Fish. Oh, no. I saw him grab it. I think I set the hook before he had it. Oh, did he? Yeah, that was a nice fish, guys. Just missed him. Fish? Fish on. Dad decided to get on the boat today. <laughs> He's just getting out here. Yeah, super skinny. That's weird. Dad's just getting out here, just got off of work. First couple casts. The legend's back in action. <laughs> Jackhammer. What the hell? Let's go sit by that lady's dock. Oh, there's one. Fish on, giant. <laughs> Old Rocky. Haven't caught a rock bass in a long time. Seems like. Little Rocky, no giant. On the chatter, but these rock bass seem to bite everything. They're always hungry. Little guy. There he goes. So guys, I am just getting back to the house. I just put the boat in the garage and it was a really fun day out on the water today. I ended up catching, I think four or five fish and my dad actually came out. He was just getting out of work 
and he came out for a little while and he managed to catch that one pike in today's video so that was really cool um i seemed to catch all my fish on that chatterbait a lot of them were chasing it right to the boat and i got that one fish that big bass it got off at the boat so that sucked but it seems like i've been missing a lot of big bass lately i don't know what it is if my hooks aren't sharp or something but i don't know guys but it was pretty cool getting out there i also ran into three different subscribers or followers out on the water and they came and said hi i think one of the guys names was garrett and jack they ran into me out on the water they said they were looking all over the lake for me so that is super cool guys really appreciate you guys coming to say hi and also if you guys are around the lake orion area i'm gonna start leaving stickers on my truck for you guys to come grab them i tested it out today and i left five stickers on my windshield and i got done and they were all gone and i think i had four or five people message me and said thanks that they came and grabbed the stickers so that is pretty cool guys really appreciate all the support so thanks a lot for watching today's video and we'll see you guys in the next one stay tuned headed to st Clair tomorrow see you guys